Hello and welcome to another Fallout 76 event video. Today we're going to be doing an event called Free Range. Now, Free Range spawns at uh, three different locations on the map. This one here is in the forest, there's another one in the Savage Divide, and another one in the mire. So we're going to have to escort three Brahmin to a nearby farm and protect it from local wildlife. So to begin this, we have to get a Shepherd's Crook. Now, if you read this too, there will be a, a directive. Uh, attach Shepherd's Hook, target Brahmin, use Shepherd's Hook, confirmation directive, Aaron Holt Homestead. So, it makes sense as to why we are doing this. Uh, so, we have Nuka, Kaula, Bourbon, and Daisy. And if you simply interact, so herd, uh, whilst the Shepherd Crook is equipped, uh, you'll mosey them along. That's why I like equipping it to my hotbar so I can switch between my primary weapon and uh, these slow-ass cows. Once they get on track, they tend to do fine. Sometimes when you first come up, they're kind of off of a, a path for them and they'll just they'll spend a moment dancing around. Uh, Nuka Kaula, do not attack the Scorched. Oh, for Pete's sake. That's new. Okay. I will spend just the briefest moment killing him. And finding a magazine in here somewhere. It's about as long as I'm gonna spend looking for it. I can come back to that after the event. There's often uh, magazines and bobbleheads at that site. So you will get a notice when the Brahmin are under attack. And it's good to make sure you see to all the Brahmin, because sometimes some run away. And there'll be a wolf attacking them. So that is the sound of a vicious sheep squash. Um, so that will, when that call happens, that will scatter some of the cows the Brahmin, and we're going to have to just uh, escort them back. Come on, stop being a coward. It's easier with two people because if there's a wave of enemy that comes, um, sort of one person can stay with one group of cows and the other can stay with the other. And for completing this, there's the more cows we keep alive, the uh, higher chance we have of getting more um, plans for um, a sheep squash staff, shepherd's crook, and a uh, uh, sheep squash club. Because there's three melee weapons that came out with this, and the only way to get mod plans for it is to do this gun. Some more baddies over here. Ooh, there's a legendary enemy somewhere. Oh, is this a part of the wolf horde quest? That's why. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a wolf horde event as well. I've never seen them at the same time. I haven't done a video on the wolf horde. I'll, uh, it's up. Frequently, I'll do it. Okay, so once we get the Brahmin into the pen, there's gonna be a sheep squash that spawns. And we just gotta take him down. It's always good to let everybody who's doing the event get a hit on it. It's uh, just policy, or sort of common courtesy. There we go. I gained a level. 
Oh, my bats targeted over the reward. Oh no, there we go. Stim pack, right away, purified water. Um, mutton meat pie. Let's go over here. So, got the legendary that I'm gonna drop. So we got the heavy sheep squash shaft and mutton meat pie. So again, you always kind of get one recipe, and then if you bring back all three, you have a chance at getting a third recipe, and you get more rewards. So you basically only get two of those rewards. Um, so you get that extra aid item, the extra ammo item, and another plan, depending on how well you do. I'm just going to give this guy a thumbs up. And see if we can find that legendary wolf that we punched to death. Uh... Somewhere over here. There's a description that a legendary has mutated. Is a vicious wolf the same? Nope. Okay, well, that's about as long as I'm gonna spend looking for it. These only drop uh, one, so oh, wolf pack leader. Meat pile, meat pile, yeah, why? Yeah, it's as long as I can spend looking for it. Anyways, that's it for um, free range. It gets harder once you get into the mire because if you, there's more than one person, you'll actually get two sheep squash that spawn at the end of it, uh, which can be a bit, uh, uh, it might be tough just with two people to kill both of them without them killing the Brahmin, here in the forest, it's the easiest. Um, and again, the rewards end up being the same regardless of where you do it. Anyways, if you've enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing. If you have any comments or suggestions, please post them below. Thank you very much, and I'll catch you in the next video.